Let's check out the place. Have the deeds in my car if you need it. <coughs> That's fine. I know you bought the place. It was in the papers. I see. As you know, the building consists of four floors. And each floor is pretty well identical to the next, uh, apart from the ground floor, of course, with the entrance lobby. So, what plans have you got for the place? I'm going to be uh, renovating it. We get a hotel. Well, I've uh, shown you the basics. Um, if I'm not required, I can. Uh, I've got other duties to attend to. No brother, I'll be uh, I'll be here for quite some time. My business partner's on his way over. He'll be coming to look at it as soon as he arrives. In the meantime, I'll just be visualising, drawing up a plan. Give you the keys. I'll come back later. Thanks. Yeah, the place is great. Bit of a <laughs> bit of a shit hole at the minute, like, but bit of time, bit of money. Could be a real hotspot for celebrities. <laughs> I just think of the press. What time do you say your train was delayed for? All right. Okay then. I'll see you when you get here. Okay, bye.
you doing back? Come for the photos I left behind. What? These? I, that girl. I've seen that girl. I've seen her in there. Who is she? She was... She was my granddaughter. After her parents died in a tragic accident a few years ago, she came to live with me. But she, she couldn't deal with the pain and... she fell into a deep depression and became suicidal. Well, I tried to help but the, there was nothing I could do. And so she, she still lives on in this house. I've only seen her a few times, but she's turned white, totally white. But her eyes are all red. And I need to keep her here to protect her. I'm so sorry. 